Building mental resilience is an important part of working on yourself. By developing mental resilience, many aspects of your life can improve your achievements, well-being, and behavior. This translates into benefits and outcomes such as realization of goals and objectives, coping with stress, taking advantage of opportunities, coping with the stages of the transition process and with the change, meeting deadlines and limiting absenteeism, completing professional, personal, and developmental tasks such as trainings, studies, projects, etc. Better use of your own skills, effective leadership, as well as improved social skills and employability. The development of mental resilience can be represented as a process. To start developing your resilience, you first need to be aware of the need to do something and make a commitment to action. The learning process is initiated by acting, experiencing, which is experimenting with a new technique, tool, approach and behavior. Next step is reflection which is considering why and how the new approach, behavior or tool brings results and benefits. It is worth naming them, if possible, measure them specifically. If it really brings results, it is worth implementing them in everyday activities and using it as so-called targeted action. If something works, repeat it regularly, preferably every day until it becomes a habit. Otherwise, it is easy to go back to bad habits and old habits, so it should be a continuous process. The process of continuous learning and building mental resilience can be presented as follows. Defining the main results, assessment of mental resilience and other aspects of personality and abilities, feedback for the individual and secure engagement, coaching or training, presenting ideas and activities to perform. Facilitating reflection, the individual recognizable benefits. Reassessing changes, mental resilience and key outcomes. An important aspect to remember is the so-called self-confidence, so pay special attention to it. If a person has a low level of self-confidence in their possibilities, skills and interpersonal relationships, it may be difficult to make progress in developing and strengthening mental resilience. In conclusion, it is safe to say that resilience is the ability to deal with a situation. A mentally resilient person does not get blocked or gives up. They can defend what they believe in. Resilience is dealing with pressure, distractions and people who try to distract us. Mental resistance consists of focus, discipline, self-confidence, patience, perseverance, responsibility without complaints or excuses, visualization, tolerance to effort, also physical, and a positive approach. Undoubtedly, it also includes sacrifice and self-renunciation. In addition, what is extremely important, it is combined with a perfectly disciplined will that does not allow the thought of surrender. It is a state of mind and it can be called a character in action. Summing up, high mental resilience is associated with focusing on achievement.